stop. Sorry to get up in the camera. I want to make sure it was working. What's up? It's your girl Toya back at you again with another video trying to give you an update of what I've been going through since I've been in Las Vegas. I've been here three weeks. Again, living apartment, living from hotel to hotel. Um, I'm going I'm to pray to the Lord that we don't have to end up being in the streets because of these. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. It may be some good ones out there, but the ones here in Las Vegas, I have to just tell you about them. Because of the rude Latinos that's out here, they say that Las Vegas is a hospitality state. Well, I really don't see that when I'm speaking to half of these Latinos. And I'm trying to keep my cool and trying to not to get mad because I know our fucking tongue lashed the shit out of you. Um, my mom just called a Clark County Commission. They transferred her to someone else. And then a, a, another person transferred her to um, services. The young lady was in a call center, Latino descent. And my mother's like, well, I moved out here because of the weather. The weather, you know, was kind of hard on me. All right, so how's the heat for you? How's the weather for you? Well, we could give you, I mean, everything that she said was really rude and disrespectful. You can't be a hospitality state hiring these Latinos who don't know how to speak to the people. Um, I'm not going to deal with that right now. I'm, I, just, I, I just don't understand it. I am the type of female I will cuss you out and be ready to fight. You will not talk to my mama with disrespect. I get it. Las Vegas is in the government state, so there's no state taxes. But unfortunately, the government needs to take over Las Vegas because obviously they don't know how to take care of people when they're sitting out here homeless. There should not be a mass majority of people out here homeless. They should have certain resources to where it shouldn't be like that. There you got people coming from other states and you got these Latinos who you, these white folks put in as managers. Sorry. Y'all need to evaluate them a little more. Yes, they're a little bit cheaper, but they're a little bit ruder, which will make you lose a lot of business. If you want to gain business, you need to hire very professional ones and monitor their ass. You need to do a, mo a monitor on them every six to nine months. Every six months to, to see their progress because the way that that young lady talked, she was very, very rude. And I almost had lost my mind i was cracking in the inside and she was just rude i'm so well i could give you something that my mom is talking is she over talking customer service y'all have no idea what customer service is y'all need to head back midwest and they'll show you what customer service is because obviously y'all lack that professionally i am so upset right now i'm trying to calm down oh my god my mom's coming here now hold on you got the key what you need my I ain't gonna do you no good. I don't care, but that was so fucking disrespectful. What it made me. They don't know who it was that you spoke with. And then they, when they transfer you, they're supposed to give you a number just in case you get disconnected who to speak to. And what they say gonna do? I don't know. I couldn't. I, I just left it on the voice. No, somebody. You needed to know who you trapped because I. You lucky I didn't cuss that bitch out. I would have cussed her out and made her feel real bad because I gotta go. I, I know you want to vent, but I gotta go. That's not customer service. Huh? Not one bit. That's not customer service. I would been to slap the shit out that bitch. If I didn't, they only do it when you're on the phone because I've been to beat these hoes ass. I know. Don't open that. Oh. I, I just don't understand. They just so fucking rude. And that was a black one. No, the, that was a Latino that said that shit. Mm -hmm. That was a motherfucking Latino because I heard her broken English. How's the weather working for you? Oh, well, that's good. She sounded more threatened that you was here than trying to help you. Like you taking something from her. She probably ain't got her fucking green card or she on the work citizen. I'm, I'm trying to calm down because I'm really mad now. Don't talk to my mama with disrespect and she ain't never disrespected you. Don't talk to her with disrespect. I wasn't talking to her. I know. And the shit that she said, oh, I'm going to start recording every time you're on the phone with them. I'm just going to start doing that. Cause they so fucking disrespectful it makes no That's why I, sense I put at all on voice so you can hear them. girl you almost got her cussed out i almost called her wet back and every goddamn thing else i had to catch That's myself because i'm Sorry. not racist but i will cut into your ass when you say something about talk disrespectful to my mom i will cut into your ass i don't give a fuck about your feelings because you didn't give two fucks about mine when you was talking to me wrong and they, and they say this me, but they ain't gonna help you yeah, that, because it's a senior citizen state, but at the same time, we were taken. You didn't took my apartment. You gave me all the information of how to set up my voice, how to set my, how to form my mail, how to get internet and, 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 and my TV, and a reference number to it. But, but, well, yeah, but then, family of one. they basing it off the income, so 
I'm, I'm really just getting upset right now. I ain't never seen this much fuckery in my life. This is probably why people do go back. And they trying to bully you to go back. It's something that they don't want you here for. I don't know what. But it kind of bully. And it's, it's the Latinos. I know. It's not the whites. It's not the blacks. It's the Latinos. Okay. So, I'm going to fight this out till I can't fight it no more. Because we ain't got no choice. My furniture here and every goddamn thing else. What are we going to do? Mama, stop worrying. We're going to find something to do. Okay. I'm going to get at you 